I got excited by the idea of being able to show as a filmmaker what I thought love looked like. Being able to talk about first love and this very epic love story, I think the message is just really inspiring. I don't care if we have 10 days or one week or one day, I want you to spend it with me. And if I do? I promise you, it'll be the best 10 days of your life. My agent called me and said, we're sending you a script. And uh, I said, what is it? And they said, there was a little bit of a beat. They said, it's endless love. I noticed that Shauna Festi had written it, and I really like her as a writer. By the time I got to page 16, I was going, I was that guy who fell in love. I knew what it felt like to fall in love with the first time, and I fell in love with the script immediately. You're Jay Butterfield. David, right? Endless love is the classical codependent romantic story filled with love and lust and youth and angst. Would you sign this? It's a modern day epic love story that still feels very grounded, very relatable, romanticized version of how we all remember our first love. Shauna talks a lot about this theme of this movie as being fearless and fighting for what you believe in. I, I want to, but... I don't care about the internship. I want to be with you for the summer. And stay. <laughs> Shauna talked about it from day one. Believe in love, fight for love, enjoy love. I've wanted to kiss you since the 10th grade. I couldn't go another minute without telling you that. But when you fall in love the first time, you know, it's exhilarating and the highs and lows of that first love that you can't really experience ever again. So exciting to like fall for someone and then go through those steps and those motions. David. Me and her wanted to bring back like that childlike emotion of just purely just think with your heart. Watching that first love is really fun and has so much wish fulfillment for a young audience or someone who's had that, who still has such strong memories of that first time of falling in love and what a roller coaster ride it is. There's two different love stories in this movie. I think love is a complex thing over the course of time. He's falling in love with her. Well, she's not ready for that. <laughs> of course she is. She's 18. It's her time. So what should I do? I should just encourage her to fall in love and have her heart broken? Yes, you should. I think she'd be great at it. I was. I hope that the people that are my age remember what it feels like to fall in love for the first time. That's what I want to find, true love, the kind that you fight for, and not just with any girl, but the girl. And when I find that, that's all I need. To love. <laughs> Alex Pettifer plays David, and he plays him with a real sense of possession and pride and makes him into a really strong character. You know, I really respect your daughter, sir. I'd do anything to make her happy. I think she's amazing. He brought a real sense of nobility, someone who you believe may have a darker side, but also someone who is capable of great joy, great love. He brings a sense of authenticity to it with how he treads lightly around the family. That's amazing! I never thought I'd hear that sound again. And has an understanding of what they're going through, and that's something that brings a lot of reality. Jay told me how much this car meant to you. And I tried to rack my brain around something I could do, seeing as, you know, we got off on the wrong foot. He can bring real complexity to scenes, and women love him. That's kind of the requisite. In a love story, you pass the guy that women love. He just has that charisma. You can't take your eyes off him. Ladies are going to flock to this movie. Are you kidding me? 